I got four bras and they all that we call that Ballin', doing this is my calling Flow is so appalling My phone off and she all right, guys, it's been a while since I was on here. Don't look at me like that, please. Don't look at me like that. I feel silly doing this. All right, guys, it's been a while since I was last on here. And as you can probably see behind me, a lot has changed. But before I get into all of that, I'm just going to install a few bits of uh, arrow. And then I will update you on what's been going on while I've not been on here. That's the size cross extensions installed. Um, I didn't get, or well, we didn't get around to doing the uh, the lip Remind extensions. Huh? Yeah, you are. So I'll be doing that at a different date. Um, well, as to where I've been and why I haven't shown any of this on YouTube to you guys, it's uh, basically because I haven't had a time. Yeah, I've been racing against weather and just life in general really just been busy just busy working full time just don't have the time to get a camera out set it up walk you through what i'm doing i need to do it so i just need to get out do it while i can because the weather is unpredictable and just get out of the way that's why i've not been able to um, show you anything but if you follow me on instagram i've been uh, putting the uh, i've been giving quite frequent updates on what i've been getting up to and whatnot so um yeah i'm gonna try making more frequent videos um I'm gonna show how to install, let me just show it right quick. These sequential uh, daytime running lights and um, um, I don't know, bits and bobs here and there. So uh, yeah, I guess I'll be, uh, oh, actually, let me just quickly walk you through what I've actually done since the last time. Um, I've installed coilovers, completely dropped that, uh, 65 mil, according to what it says on the box, the back. Yeah, it could get lower but I haven't found I haven't found anything that can go any lower than that so um, kind of stuck with that for now uh, what else have I done right I uh, also did this wing yeah custom I don't know if I should show you how I got that on there or not because I quite like being the only one with it but uh, whatever um what else have I, I think that's pretty much it oh right and I got a new logo and made some new stickers uh, okay, stuck them on there I uh, got some new uh, blue gel badges because I quite, I quite like those. I was on the inside. 
Oh yeah, good to that. There's the uh, blue job badge, blue start engine badge, uh, and um, that was uncomfortable. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, whatever. And um, ah, wow. Okay, let me talk you through quickly through this. Um, I got this fender flares, right? As you can see, fender isn't the best because they're quite rigid, and in the rear it was just <laughs> a lot worse a lot worse so i had to cough up some money and get these ones much 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 more expensive but totally worth it because they just they just mold to the body really well but they are <laughs> really expensive it costs more than twice what it costs for the entire kit so four pieces just for a pair of the rear ones so quite expensive um issues i've had um no Robbie. Yeah, I'm not having any rubbing issues. Um, I don't really have any issues. Oh, on my EP, I, had, I used to have a lot worse issues, but it seems like this has a lot more clearance. Um, this has dropped as low as it's going to go. So as you can see, quite low. And um, basically, the only issues were going to, when you, when you go this low, you run, I'm only running 17s. Running 17s, um, I'm running 245s by 40s. So not quite, relatively low profile which means i have a, a well, which means that the entire car sits lower but it also means that i have a bit more clearance because if you see in there i don't know if this is gonna pick up but basically in there is the washer fluid reservoir yeah if you're running any if you're running uh, bigger wheels and you go this low you're gonna make contact with that you're gonna have issues with that um if you go too low in the rear you're gonna have issues with the exhaust uh catching um well <laughs> It's basically the same as it was before, but um, actually, wait, it's not nearly the same as it was before. Before, uh, the last video I put up, I hadn't done any of the uh, wide body, arch, whatever I want to call it, stuff. But um, yeah, wing, arches, wheels, uh, coilovers, low, arrow, not quite down with the arrows, the arrow yet. What I'm left with to do in the rear is the diffuser. Um, that's gonna come a bit later and then I'm gonna uh, look at making the exhaust quite a lot louder but um, yeah that, yes how she sits at the moment all right so uh, yeah that's that's things has at this time at the moment I'll be keeping you up to date when I have the time well I have a time now because it's a bank holiday so we've got today off work so that's that's great stuff but yeah this this is uh, this is basically how she's sitting I'll be doing a bit more work on her and I'm gonna try and record all of that and put it on this channel. Show you guys what's going on. So uh, yeah, let me know if you're interested in that wing. Let me know if you are. I'll, uh, I'll do an update on the wing. And I think I'll do an update as well on how to install the Mugen spoiler on the, on these FN1s cause my God, it's a pain in the ass. But yeah, I'll be catching you guys in the next one.